I kind of want to see this thing. Oh my god. I want to see this thing. I feel like this is it really. Whoa, look at this thing. Oh my god. So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and welcome back to SCP Containment Breach. So you guys in the last episode, first of all, super enjoyed the episode, but you also told me. Supposedly, I'd only seen a small handful of the SCPs. There is so many more within this game that I've got to see. Now, before we get into the horror of this episode, let me just say this, though. The last episode on this game got 10,000 likes. That is absolutely unbelievable, and uh, I guess thank you so much for that as well. I think you guys really enjoyed the creepy atmosphere and, you know, just the way you got to explore the different facilities. Now, I'm feeling like for this episode, I'm going to start a brand new game because you do get a new layout every single time and there may be components that weren't quite in the last seed. And with all that said, I'm ready to jump straight back into this next episode. So if you guys are too, let me just go ahead and do this. And let's get back into this, shall we? The freak you looking at? Yeah, you're right, actually, I should, uh... I should keep the glasses on, shouldn't I? SCP-939, uh, endorphic pack-based predators which display a trophy of various systems similar to trigolith. It possesses highly complex vocal cords, and its primary method of luring prey is the imitation of... Wait, so what, that thing speaks like a human? Now there is some things, guys, I gotta see before I go believing that, but we're back in SCP though, unfortunately. Dude, you still dead? Uh, yep, he's still dead. All right, now before we go doing anything too drastic, let me just double check, that SCP is gone. This one is already roaming the facility and I actually learned a lot about this one too. I never knew before that it was like a full stone object. Hold on, let me just blink. I gotta time my freaking blinks. Okay, let me take this document here. Uh, yep, he ain't in there. Oh, he's been bashing off the- was there right? <laughs> when the statue is left unobserved and line of sight is broken by the conscious being, the statue becomes animate, moving at speeds documented between 60 to 90 kilometers an hour. I think this thing weighs like 600 kilograms or 468. If this thing hits you, you're about to implode. Uh, wait, 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 what? Hold up just one second. There was some kind of sound. And what followed right there was death. We gotta associate that sound then with some kind of uh, animate being. Maybe it was actually the stone monster. If so, I've got questions. Who the freak opened the door on this guy? I ain't about to find out. Let's get things moving. Here we go. Ooh. Yeah, this is a totally new seed. I don't remember this zone. What do we have here? We got SCP-0. Wait, what? What is this? Cognition hazard is that? What the freak? Okay, let me just F5 this junk. That is saving, by the way. A music note. Uh, I'm gonna seal this door off. What the freak? I never encountered this one last time then. Is there any documentation on this SCP? The heck? Oh, uh, my hands are off. My character was doing this by his own will. Um, what is it doing? What, there's like intense music, guys. I can't even play any of myself. I don't know what's, what? There's like talking. Um, yeah, wait, what? The music is stabbing us? What the, dude. I don't understand. We're like dying. Why can't we move? I can't do nothing to get out of this. Why is our character like going through conflicted thoughts? Is that us talking? Or is there something in the music page? What? What, what? what the heck? What? Okay, I'm about to Google this in a second. What? This is so creepy. I don't understand what's going on. Our character was like sucked into this. You see? What the heck? The music straight up. You know what? I'm not listening to this. I'm already just going to kill me in a second. Okay, guys, listen to this right now. So, SCP-012 is to be kept in a darkened room at all times. If the object is exposed to light or seen by personnel using a light frequency other than infrared, remove personnel for mental health screening and immediate physical. Wait, what does that mean? Multiple test subjects were allowed to access the score. In every case, the subjects mutilated themselves in order to use their own blood to finish them. So wait, I was cutting myself right there? Yeah, I see you right there. You know what? You can stay behind that closed door. Skip that. All right, let's keep moving anyway. I'm going to close every door. Like that music sheet. Like, can it chase me? Because I don't want to be hanging out right now. You know what I'm saying? Oh, look at this room. This one's a weird one. It's like every single time it's different. So wait, channel 13 or like 13? And then lucky for some, you know, you know what? What? Is literally, I found every new SCP. Can I read about this guy? Like, hey, what's going on? Analyze the situation. The door in front of this guy is locked, so no concern. So, uh, you know what? I'll be seeing you. You look very... What the oh! What the heck? Look. What the heck is this dude? Like, what's up with his face? Well, uh, okay. Containment has been failed, okay? Shut behind there. Do not enter test chamber without protective equipment. Uh, I mean, it doesn't matter. He's already done. He can teleport. Ah, wow, okay. You know what? Let me just close him in there. So, is he aggressive? Wait, is he gone? Hello? Oh, what the heck? The music stopped. He's just stood there. Like, why so stiff, you know? I wonder if someone got fired for that. Like, they thought that SCP was a joke. Like, hey, Bobby, close. Why is he out again, okay? There's two new SCPs straight off the bat. 
Uh, let's go ahead and check up here. Got this back room again. Very foggy. It's always foggy back here. Is there like a, a fuse that's like short circuited or something? I mean, this is buzzing away, but we can't interact with it. We've got some documentation on the different SCPs right here. SCP, is that 93? That's the uh, like lizard thing? Oh, so that thing's roaming? Freaking lizards roam in this place, man. Like, what the heck? Okay, let's just continue on as normal as we can. Like, I'm about to say, like, normal. Let's just go through this place, but we end. I mean, one that's like a 468 kilogram stone statue thing zooming around somewhere. I wonder if you can see him moving the cameras. That's something I've not really uh, thought about. Maybe as long as there's someone's eye, at least, on the thing, that's how we can uh, stop it from moving. Ooh, that looks kind of foggy. Oh! I swear to goodness, man. Like, this dude is about to freaking get punched in a minute. Authorized personnel only. Yeah, just me, not you, okay? I'll be seeing you. Let's go ahead and go down. Uh, let me just save my game right now. We're in an elevator. Authorized personnel. I hope I'm authorized. Somewhat. Okay. Oh, shoot. Okay, no, we're going back up. Okay, okay, okay. So, some kind of gas chamber. And I'm still dying, by the way. What about going up? Okay, hold up. Okay, we can't go up. That's interesting. So, I guess we are going through this way. Uh, let's go ahead and see what we got. What is that noise? Something through here. Okay, blink, blink, blink. Open this. Ooh, so we know what that is. That's like that hornet nest thing. Oh, this door. Okay, what do we have this side here? Like a small corridor. Blink away. There we go. Hmm. Have we? Hi. This place is getting strange. I feel like there's new updates, even though I haven't changed my game. Oh, not that guy. Oh, come on right now. I oh. hate this dude. Of all that, yeah, yeah, roar like a dragon. Why don't Where the animal at? Why the man blood? I think that statue was beyond that door. You know, the one I opened the door. I didn't check through. I turned my back, blinked, and... And we're back in the game. I'm having a load of fun with this game even still, though, guys. I, I don't know. I love the, uh, just the idea behind it. Open this door. Let me just check through here real quick. Uh, it seems safe. Close that. Literally. Whoa. What the? Um, hold on. What is this? SCP-914, non-standard space-time? How about I hop in this thing and, like, appear in Moscow or just anywhere but here, you know? Intake, um, it's got, like, a dial, rough course, fine, and it outputs something within here. Can I turn that? Oh! Oh, for God's sake. Whoa! Okay, let me stand in the corner. So, it puts something through this object. This is it running through. It's slowing down, the mix. Look at that, the output opens. Huh. Oh, hold up. You know, if I had, hold up, I don't have no objects to even test this out with. I'm gonna have to note this location as best I can. I kind of want to put something in there and then see what happens on the uh, output of it. Ooh. Now, do I like this? I know, the auxiliary ventilation. Wait, 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 wait. If I press this, hold up a sec. Will that be to do with the elevator? Like, will it restore? Oh, hang on a sec. I'm gonna save as this is doing its thing. I feel like this is good progress. And I'm like, I'm spamming that save button. I'm gonna be honest. What the heck was that? Okay. Seems good. I don't know what this dripperture is in the middle as well. Like, someone peed themselves. I think we're done. There you go. Dude, we just enabled it. That feels like a good thing. Look, you can see. Is perma pumping something? Okay, no, close that, close that. I gotta remember to blink before I go open and stuff. That was a good thing. That was a real good thing. We're actually progressing in this game. Like, there is some, I guess, element of progression here. What do we have in here? Oh, you know what? These are... Dude, I think if this is the gas mask, hold up. Yeah, okay. How about I try this in that machine? And then here, we don't have anything... Okay, that blink was strange. I don't know why that freaked me out. SCP-1499 is a Soviet GP-5 gas mask. A seal test performed on the object suggests that the object retains its original functionality. Upon wearing the mask, test subjects report completely different surroundings than they were in prior to wearing it. Okay. Have I put this thing on before? Let me just go ahead and re-equip this. So... Oh, heck no. What is this place, man? I've seen this so many times, but... I don't know what it is. It's so... Weird. It's like, uh, I guess a destroyed city, maybe like after the fallout and these guys, do they represent like the lost humans? Yo, dude, did you die or something? Like, can we just get this out of the way? Where's he going? Like, no milk? He's got a pace on right there. He knows exactly which shop he's going to. I'd rather not wear this today. Let's try and cure this thing and see if it works. No, 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 no. Nope. Nope. I hate that SCP so much. Let's go ahead and get away from this thing as fast as we can. Okay, blink. Uh, ooh. I feel like now we're heading, like, a totally reverse way. So we come to this room again. A time switch closes the door. This, I guess, is a way to escape some of the SCPs. Because uh, then, like, you're through. And then, uh, maybe we can go back on ourselves, I guess? Uh -oh. oh, we're gonna be decontaminated. I mean, I do stink, so under the arms. Ah. This is an interesting place. Uh, never seen anything like this before. SCP-714. And that one is closed off. Okay, that's a ring. 
I think that one is. Seemingly nothing more than a green jade ring. It is shown to be able to expand and contract to fit perfectly on the finger of anyone who touches it. It causes exhaustion, compulsion to rest and sleep, slowed reaction, sluggish movement, then reduced mental capacity, mental shield as a dubious benefit, chemical tolerance. Just as their mind's block metric influences the bodies of SCP-714, where it slows and nullifies the effects of various chemicals. We had one more door over this side here to check out SCP-860 and 1025. Now, what do we have in here? sealed off. So whatever that SCP is, I'm probably glad it's still locked away in there. And this one, it's an empty box. So maybe these are two that are inbound. It looks like these guys aren't actually in the game just yet. So I think really two more things I want to do for this episode then is uh, go back to the machine that can apparently make things safe or it, like does something to them, like the input output thing. Then I, uh, I'm kind of interested to see what we could do really with the like elevator thing. We did the auxiliary system. So we should have access to that maybe? Level, whoa, hold up. The freak. What? Where are we? Got like a little station down here. Hey, who's working on this? Right, let me just head up here. This is a strange little thing. What does this separate? Oh, it's like another level three. Ooh, that don't sound good. Did you hear that the moment I stick near it? Whoa. What the heck? Oh, we're in like the middle of the, uh, I guess, North South Pole, wherever they do experiments. This is typical for like a highly scientific facility. Because they don't want to be seeing, you know, any trespassers. And like, in the middle of this place, you ain't going to get no one here. Nope. Nope. Oh, okay. Like, let's go past him. Oh, my God. Whoa! Whoa okay. Woo! Okay. Dude. What the heck? Oh, of course, he gets through areas. This is so weird. Is there anything? Oh, it looks fairly barren. Okay, one door there. Nothing that side. Oh, wait. What's this dude doing? Um, yeah, like, you need a hand? He figured it out. Okay, get round him, get round him, go, 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 go! They're still in behind this door. Hopefully this counts. Okay, there you go. Take care. Oh, he's right. Oh, I'm dead. So this is like a fairly dead zone for now, you know? There's not much more going on. Okay, let's get... Uh, wait, what? Hello? Oh, come on right now. And I'm dead. I, I got my back snapped. Is this guy like SCP-173 teaming up? That's frustrating. I just realized in between times where you die, even though you save your progress, it doesn't save any items that you pick up. I gotta get like the helmet thing, like the gas mask, and also get all the way back without dying. Oh, what the heck, man? I'm gonna save my game. Wow, this is a bit of a sticky situation, right? That's the only way I need to get back. And like, he's blocking it. Guys, I'm gonna try and get round him, but like, if I die... Okay, hold up, hold up. Dude, that backside of that guy needs a freaking wipe, you know? Oh my god! Okay, just about good. I can't believe I made that. All right, got the gas mask. At least that's one thing. So I'll try and run it through that machine if I can get back there. Right, let's get this vent thing done as well. If we could try and get both of this done in the first time or like the first life, that would be like the best scenario possible. But I don't know. I really don't know so much. Yes, here we go. Okay, here's the elevator. I haven't found the machine, guys, which, uh, you know, could use the gas mask. But I turned off the auxiliary system. So, hold up. Oh, oh shoot. Okay, I don't like that. Pausing the game doesn't stop the ambience. So, okay, my butt is still perma-clenched. If I save now, like, you know, with this... I'm saving, I'm not saving. I don't know. I was feeling like if I save now... We... Oh, I hear those claws on the floor. Um, upstairs or downstairs, you know? Or, like, balcony. I can't do... I gotta be ready to, like, go. It is somewhere cl if Oh crap. There is something here. You know- Oh, I don't know what this is! This is the layer of 939, isn't it? I think it- is it 939 or 949? The, uh, imitation thing. Though it's not imitating nothing, probably because it sees no human. I don't know. Should I go for it? Oh man, oh, I've just cracked myself. Let's take a look around here. Okay. This is freaking stupid. No way! And he is here?! Oh my god, this is so stupid. I'm- Oh my god. Just when you get there. That is so frustrating. Like, I'm right by the monster, but I can't even explore the place because that freaking stone thing. Maybe if I wait a little bit, it might disappear, the stone thing. Day two. <sighs> okay, guys, we're going back down. I'm not going to wait. I want to get through this place as fast as I can. You know, this is progression. Okay, look, we're here. Let me blink again. Okay, where's the stone statue? He's not there. Okay, we've got a door over here. Press this. <gasps> okay. Dude, things are roaming down. I saw it. Oh my god. And, no way! This is like the what? Holy crap, look at that thing! This, this is crazy. This is freaking crazy. Got like a trap door there. Is that where they put the food in or something? I don't know, guys. I don't know. Okay, I'm still progressing. I can barely see anything. Really hard to see. Okay, this is... Okay, wait. I think I got away from it. I think? I don't know. What to expect when I open this door, though. What the? Guys, I'm like progressing. There's another elevator here, I think. Press the button. We about to get out of this alive? Ah! Oh my god, no, 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 no! 
Go back up! Okay. You know what? That dude can go. <laughs> In the freaking elevator! I kind of want to see this thing. Oh my god. Guys, I want to see this thing. I feel like this is it, really. I am literally crapping myself right now. I am serious right now, guys. I am literally crapping myself. I'm going to go and confront this thing. Let's get it over with. Okay, where is he? Okay, he's coming. Wait, what? I don't know what... Does that mean he's... Si I don't... No! God, please, no! Whoa, look at this thing! Oh my god! Whoa! Let's see if we can have... Okay, that thing's snapping my butt! Okay, let's go through here. I'm about to run out of sprint. This thing has got perma sprint. Whoa! He is so aggressive. And I'm about to become me. Yeah, I'm about to become his dinner. Well, there you have it, guys. Don't go down there ever again. All right, then, guys. Well, that's going to be it for this episode of SCP Containment Breach. I feel like we pretty much explored everything so far that the Unity has to offer. Or should I say Unity version? We explored uh, 939. We got into the layer, thankfully. We didn't get to use the machine, which does, like, an input-output thing. And then something happens in between. Maybe that's not even in the game by this point. But, I mean, we didn't even need the gas mask anyway. I'll be definitely coming back to this, though, once this game re-updates. Because it really feels like a great game this one there's so much going on with the scps and they always catch you off guard which is actually a nice thing like Bruh. can i say that's a person who's experiencing this like what the heck but anyway though guys if you did enjoy this video why not drop me that like rating and hey if you're new around here why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here so thank you so much for watching this video guys i of course hope you did enjoy and i will of course see you on the next one